Whisker, YouTube, it's your man BG Tech Life. Um, got another case video for y'all. Y'all see what I got on deck on the charger, on the charger, y'all. So I'm not sure how this video is going to go because I got my Galaxy Note 7, the silver titanium one, on the charger as I'm shooting this video. Got a case video for y'all. The Poetic uh, Revolution case for the Galaxy Note 7 in black. Now, I'm not sure if they had one with a screen protector because this specifies the one without the screen protector, which I like more. I'm not really into screen protectors, especially ones that's built into phone cases because they're a little too thick and um, they just cloud my interaction with the screen. And as you can see, usual poetic uh, packaging. As you can see, I have just like a, almost like a baggy, almost like a Ziploc bag. You can see on the back, Poetic Revolution case for the Galaxy Note 7 made in China. Let's go ahead and open it up. As you can see on the inside, I got a coupon. 10% 10, 10 off first time purchase at PoeticCases.com. Use code San Francisco. Uh, thank you for purchase and some. Wow, that was dramatic. And some installation steps. I'm pretty familiar with this build of case as far as I've had it for my S7 Edge and my HTC 10. And as you can see, you got a nice case here. It's made out of two parts. You got a TPU, and then you got polycarbonate. So as you can see, like this is the backing. Um, the back is polycarbonate, and I love these matte finishes with these uh, like black glossy uh, designs or in in them in them. I love the the uh, combination of matte black and uh, like black gloss. The sides flexible TPU. So your button's gonna be TPU, volume up and down, power button. Top is like TPU. And as you can see, the bottom is TPU. And you got covers for your Type C and your audio jack. Cutouts for your S Pen microphone, uh, speaker, or whatever. And we got some poetic branding on the inside with love from San Francisco. Shout out to Poetic for getting this out to me. As you can see, we got the Poetic P, as always, in that gloss black in the middle of that matte finish. Some Poetic branding at the bottom. This it will be the face. This is a polycarbonate. It's like a hard plastic. It's thin, though. So you might want to be careful with this part. When you, when you don't have the phone in this case, you might want to put this up somewhere because you don't want to break it. So here we go. We got the Note 7 right here. Most explosive phone in the game. Self-proclaimed explosive, most explosive phone in the game or whatever. Well, I'm not going to say self-proclaimed. I'm going to say proven most explosive phone in the game or whatever. But um, we're going to go ahead and we're going to install this into the case. So first you got your two, you got a two-part case right here. So what you're going to do is take this piece and you're going to install the phone into it. It should snap into this piece. Let's see. Snap it into the front. Snap it in like so. So we in there. So and as you can see, it actually clamps down over the phone. So the phone don't just fall out of here. You know what I'm saying? It's clamped in to the front polycarbonate. Then we're going to put it inside the backing. That sounded painful. But, um... And you're going to want to press down because the actual uh, TPU, these sides should clip in. So you always want to clean installation. You know, this is case. It's not the easiest. It's not a slap on case. You got to put a little work in. Definitely not a slap on case. You want everything looking tight. It's a new nice device. 
You got everything in. Put the audio jack piece in. I'm having a problem with that. I'm pull it behind the camera for a second. Okay, we in there. So these uh, port closures at the bottom, these port covers, they fit into the ports really snug. So that's a good thing. Keep stuff up about your ports when you're not using them. Um, as you can see, we got most of the top covered up here. That's like, um, you know, you just got a cutout for your camera, your uh, iris scanner, and um, all that up there. At the bottom, you got a little dent so you can get to your fingerprint. So you got some definitely, you definitely got some good protection with the uh, with the combination of TPU and polycarbonate, and it's definitely not a bad looking case. As you can see, let me clean this up a little bit, clean it up for y'all just a little bit. I like the gloss look that you get on the edges. You can see the edge, you get a like kind of like a gloss look off of there. So that's pretty decent. This case is $9.95. So if you're looking for some serious protection for your uh, No 7, it's not bomb proof, but it will protect the device. Got all cutouts matching. Definitely a good looking case, especially on the black one. It looks dope on the silver too, though. Like, this is the silver titanium I got. Looks dope on here. But I'm sure it looks super dope on the black one. You got your gloss. I like the combination of a matte finish with gloss. And I like the Poetic P. And I like the branding and the gloss with the matte black. It's definitely a good looking case. You got good click on your uh, buttons. You got you some gr grooves or some ridges along the side for a better grip. And you know grip is a big part of drop protection. Because with grip, you might not even drop your device. So um, shout out to Poetic, it's your man BG Tech Life. You can um, go follow me on Instagram, BG Tech Life. Follow me on Twitter, BG underscore Tech Life. And for all business inquiries, email me, bgtechlife at gmail.com. Shout out to Poetic again. Shout out to all my followers and supporters. It's your man BG Tech Life, I'm out.